Welcome to Math with Mr. J. In this video, I'm going to cover what a trapezoid is. Now simply put, a trapezoid is a quadrilateral with at least one pair of parallel sides. Let's take a look at some examples and dive in a little further. So again, trapezoids are quadrilaterals. So they have four sides and then they have at least one pair of parallel sides. So looking at example A right here, we can see that we have a quadrilateral. And then we can also see that we have one pair of parallel sides, these sides right here. Now we can mark these parallel sides by using arrow symbols on the sides. So an arrow symbol here and here. Those arrows show that those sides are parallel. Moving on to example B right here, we can see that we have a quadrilateral with one pair of parallel sides. These sides right here. So we have another trapezoid. Moving on to example C right here, this is an interesting one because we can see that we have a rectangle. But is this a trapezoid as well? Yes, this is actually technically a trapezoid because again, trapezoids are quadrilaterals with at least one pair of parallel sides. This rectangle is a quadrilateral and it has two pairs of parallel sides. So it does have at least one pair of parallel sides. So we have parallel sides right here. So let's draw one arrow on those sides. And then on our other pair of parallel sides, let's draw two arrows. And we're drawing two arrows since this is a different pair of parallel sides. We have two pairs of parallel sides here. So to be clear, this is technically a trapezoid. Trapezoid tells us we have at least one pair of parallel sides, and we do here. Now, although it's technically true, this is a trapezoid, trapezoid is not the best name. It's not the most specific or fitting name. Rectangle is. We call this a rectangle because that gives us more information about the shape. Rectangle tells us that we have two pairs of parallel sides and four right angles. Typically, we want to use the most specific and fitting name possible. So although yes, this is a trapezoid, the best name is rectangle. So something to keep in mind. Let's move on to numbers one through four, where we will determine if we have a trapezoid or not. Green check mark means yes, red X means no. So taking a look at number one, we have a quadrilateral with one pair of parallel sides. So yes, this is a trapezoid. Moving down to number two, we have a quadrilateral, but we don't have any parallel sides. So this is not a trapezoid. This is just a quadrilateral here. Moving on to number three, we have a quadrilateral with two pairs of parallel sides. So do we have at least one pair of parallel sides? Yes, so this is a trapezoid. Now, although this is technically a trapezoid, at least one pair of parallel sides, a better and more specific name for this shape is parallelogram. Parallelograms have two pairs of parallel sides. And lastly, for number four, we have a quadrilateral with one pair of parallel sides. So yes, this is a trapezoid. So there you have it. There's a basic overview of what a trapezoid is. I hope that helped. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, peace.